everybody, welcome to another wonderful Wednesday. I so a couple updates before I get started on today's video. Um, first of all, first of all, I just found out that I am five is coming to Michigan. Oh, I'm so excited! Yeah, they're gonna be having two concerts. One on no, on August 20, 20, 20th at the Loft in Lansing. If you, there's gonna be a link in the description below. In the description below, tickets cost fifteen dollars. You want more information? The um, link to the website is below. Also, they're having another concert August twenty second. August twenty second, and it's gonna be in Ann Arbor. It's gonna be at Briarwood Mall. At and if you want more information about that, go down below. I will be attending to the Briarwood Mall, to the Briarwood Mall concert. So I hope to see you to see all my fibers there. Also, um, do you guys think I should start a, a vlog? I might actually start vlogging and you know, um, taking videos of all the things I'm gonna be doing as a senior because I'm really excited about some of this stuff. I'm just I'm pumped. Like I'm I'm just so pumped. But yeah, and also I just want to kind of share the experience with you guys. So, because it's about to get crazy. So, let me know if you guys think I should start a vlog and let me know in the comments below. Okay, so enough about that. Enough of me babbling. Let's talk about this week's video. Now, unfortunately, we all, it is August, and unfortunately, we all have to go through the dreaded back to score. As I like to go, call it back to heck. So, I figured, why not? I figured why not compulse the list of things that I don't like about high school. So here it is, my video of things I don't like about high school. And it's probably gonna be part one because there are a lot of things. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Let's get let's do let's do it. Let me just grab my list here. Whoop! Let's get started. Number one. The first thing I don't understand about high school is the fact that um, why do we have to get up so early? Like, I'd be tired than a mug. Like, I'm going to be tired in a mug, and now I have to get up and then come to school with people that I know I hate, and I'm probably saying, I don't like none of you. And so now I got to deal, now I got to deal with this now? Ugh. Plus, the likelihood is I'm probably going to sleep the first hour of class, and the rest is going to go, whoop, bye. I just, it's annoying. Like, I, and especially when you got to hear that dreaded alarm cry, like, I'm just like, Shut up. How many of us actually smash our alarm clocks? Like y'all don't. I know you do. I know what you do. But yeah, it's just so pointless. Why can't school start at 12 o'clock? That would make my life a whole lot easier. I'm just saying. Number two. The fact... The teachers. Okay, now... Disclaimer. This is not for those This, I'm not talking about all teachers, because there's some teachers that, you know, they the bomb. They teach, and also they also make their class fun and for all the kids, or they really help us and they motivate us. I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about those, te those teachers that just are there for a check and don't do anything. Hi, how you doing? Let's talk for a second. So let me get this straight. You went to college to try to learn how to become a teacher, and yet... How do you not enjoy your job? I mean, like, why are you here then? If you don't like dealing with children, then why'd you sign up for a job where you have to see them almost every single day, every hour, in every hour? It's, it's pointless. I also hate the ones that just like, they're just like, you know, they're so rude for no reason. Like, literally somebody shoved a stick, a stick up their butthole, and now they're just rude and just forever mean. It's crazy. Why you gotta be so mean? What up, Taylor Swift reference? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I listen to Taylor Swift. Got a problem with it? But, yeah. I just don't get it. Like, why are you guys gotta be so rude? I mean, I didn't do anything to you. I didn't get you up at 5, five o'clock in the morning. I didn't write your lesson plans. I didn't, dr I didn't drive three hours to get where you need to be. I did nothing. Me no did nothing to you. Why are you so mad at me? See, you got me so mad. I'm using my superwoman voice. Jesus. But yeah, just tone it down. Just chill down. Before I'm about to throw this book at this book that you don't hand to me. Hand that you don't hand it to me. Number three, the food. Yeah. Okay. 
aka what I also like to call prison, um, actually good prison food. Now, the food is just straight up disgusting. I've literally had people put stuff on my plate that is moved on my tray that I literally tossed out so quick. Like, it's crazy. What's the purpose? I mean, literally, I found hair, um, hair, teeth, retainer, all this stuff in my food. I'm just sitting there just like, ew. And sometimes I can't even make out what it is. Now, if you're like me and your friend, your best friend is the vending machine, you know what you're finna do. But even then, when I don't have any money, I'm stuck with the same old food. The only time that they actually have food, good food is on pizza day. And sometimes when they serve up chicken nuggets, because let's be honest, them things is good. But other than that, it's just straight up slop. Just nothing. Slop. Crazy. I'm not, I'm not going to put your... I honestly think that if I compared prison food to the school's food, I bet the prison food will probably taste a little bit better. Number three, the clicks. Ain't nobody fresher than my mud effing click, click, click. That is a really good song. But, yeah. Okay. So, since the dawn of the 80s, we have gotten all these movies about cliques and the people in high school and all that kind of stuff. For example, The Breakfast Club. Another example, Mean Girls. And in that time, we have somewhat evolved around that because it's freaking annoying. I swear. Like, we got, we got those popular girls. We got the jobs. We got the nerds. We got the, um... The emo kids, the art kids, the drama kids, the kids that, um, the weird, those weird looking kids. And then you got the people like me that just can't find a place to group with. And don't you hate it when those popular kids that always just be walking in a group together, like they're always together at all times. Like they're never alone. What? Can y'all just like not be together? Can y'all just separate? Like that's crazy. And I also hate it when they just pick on everybody. Like they just, like they run the place. I swear, ooh, popular people, I just want to. I just want to hose you down so that way you can, I just want to, I just want to knock you off the high horse that you're on. Because it's just, it's just freaking annoying. But honestly, I'm not even a part of a clique. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to lie. I'm not a part of a clique. I have friends. I'm just not a part of a big clique or anything like that. I'm, I'm just not. But if you want, you guys can be my clique. You can all just talk. We'll call it the, the normal clique. Just a whole bunch of people just talking. About things, you guys can be in my clique. You see, I've now invited you into my clique. See, I'm accepting of all people. But yeah, it's just crazy. Like I, I can't take it. I can't take those girls who just literally just like do nothing but just talk about people. That's all they ever do. Like, can you find another hobby, or do I have to literally just Muhammad Ali you in the face? Like, it's just crazy. Like, I just hate that so much. Uh, like I could be literally just eating my lunch in peace, and they could be like, "Oh my God, she's chewing with one, with on one side." <laughs> Who does that? Yeah, she's such a loser. I know, right? Hey, you wanna go get some pop? You wanna go get some pop? You wanna go get some low-fat, non-dietary yogurt together? Yes, I love to. Like, hello, I can hear you. You know that? I swear. This was freaking white chicks. Oh, oh, you want to talk about mamas. You want to talk about mamas. Yeah. Another thing I don't understand. Okay, like I, along with the critics, and also comes bullying. Now, I've been bullied a lot in high school. I'm not going to lie. I've been bullied a lot. But, and it was hard for me. It was hard. Like, I'm not going to lie. It was hard. And I had to learn to deal with being with myself. But for those of you that don't have that much self-esteem, that they have literally just deuce, 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 deuce your self-esteem, then they had to learn, you know, to cope with yourself. I honestly believe that positive energy is just the number one thing you can do. And you know how, like, on those commercials when they tell us to stop bullying and speak up? Well, some of us can't do that because, A... Because A, either the teachers don't care enough to try or the school board doesn't even care. It is said in a statistic fact that 99.9% .9 of all high schools, of all high school administrations only care about academics and athletics of the students. Meaning they don't give a crap about, um, about everything that happens. Now, I'm not, now, this ain't all high schools. I mean, 99.9% .9 is a lot. Is mostly 100%. But not all high schools are like that. Some are very, t you know, very 
um, outlaw bullying. You know, they don't like that kind of stuff. But some of them, they just don't. But majority of them, they do. And I just don't like that. I just... It, it, it pains me. It pains me to see when people are getting picked on because of something because of something that they had no control of. Or they do have control, but they don't have enough help to help them get control of it. And if you're feeling like that, leave a comment below telling me how you feel. And I will find a way to make you feel better. Because that is my number one goal. I want to make you feel better. Because look at me. I had the courage to literally make videos for you guys every single Wednesday. And just have the uh, up and courage to not care what anybody thinks of me. And that's what you, honestly, you guys, I think you need. Because I don't discriminate against anyway. I don't care if you're gay, lesbian, bisexual, black, white, blue, purple, polka dots. I don't even care if you're a unicorn. You just, although it would kind of question me, how'd you get a chance to? Anyway, but never mind. And the last thing I, and, but that, yeah, that's probably going to be part one of many things I don't like, I don't understand, or like about high school. So make sure you subscribe to my channel, um, like this video, and share it. Uh, uh, and share it. Uh, and share it. Uh, uh, and share it. With the teachers. You need to learn something from the students. Anyway, I love, I love you, you, and you. Peace out. Peace and love.